Welcome back to our channel. Today we're delving into the world of the bladder snail, a fascinating freshwater gastropod with a rich history and surprising ecological importance. Found in various freshwater habitats worldwide, bladder snails have been quietly shaping aquatic ecosystems for centuries. But did you know, despite their small size, bladder snails possess a unique ability to self-fertilize, allowing them to reproduce rapidly and adapt to changing environmental conditions. Bladder snails, scientifically known as Ficella acuta, are characterized by their conical shells and distinct respiratory siphons. Native to freshwater environments such as lakes, ponds, and rivers, these gastropods play a crucial role in nutrient cycling and algae control. With their voracious appetite for detritus and algae, bladder snails have helped maintain water quality and promote a healthy balance of flora and fauna in aquatic growing ecosystems. To cultivate bladder snails successfully, provide a freshwater aquarium or pond with ample vegetation, oxygenation, and stable water parameters. Bladder snails thrive in slightly alkaline to neutral water with temperatures ranging from 65 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Ensure adequate hiding places and substrate for shelter and reproduction, such as aquatic plants, driftwoods, and rocks. With minimum care and maintenance, bladder snails will multiply rapidly, serving as valuable indicators of water quality and ecosystem health. Bladder snails are compatible with a wide range of aquatic organisms, including live bearers, shrimp, and peaceful community fish. Their algae eating habitats help control excess growth and maintain a balanced ecosystem in aquariums and aquascapes. However, avoid introducing bladder snails into tanks with aggressive or predatory species that may harm or prey on them. While bladder snails contribute to the health and balance of aquatic ecosystems, they can become invasive in certain environments, particularly when introduced unintentionally. Exercise caution when transferring plants, decorations, or aquarium equipment between tanks to prevent unattended bladder snail infestations. Additionally, monitor their population levels regularly to prevent overpopulation and potential negative impacts on water quality and aesthetics. As we conclude our exploration of the bladder snail, let us appreciate the vital role of these humble gastropods and maintain the health and balance of freshwater habitats. Thanks for joining us on this journey into the wonders of aquatic life. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time.